I want you to know how much self-control uncharacteristically I've displayed recently because this parcel arrived uh, two days ago actually. I was out most of the day it arrived and it was too dark to take this piece of film at that time and then the next day it was so overcast there was no light. Today is beautifully sunny and so I've waited till now to open it up and the reason that is a huge amount of self-control is that this is a box from my publisher so I am hoping that this contains copies of the new book and I wanted to share with you the moment when I unboxed it, if I can open it at all. When I started writing these books, I, I should tell you I didn't need reading glasses but, but I do now so I'm just going to put those on. Um, here we go, let's see what we've got. Well sellotaped by those lovely people at the publisher. There we go. Now this could be anything. Oh no, but it's not anything. I can see what it is now. The Fugitive and the Vanishing Man. This is the sixth book featuring Elizabeth Barnabas and it is kind of unbelievable to me that when I started writing these books some, oh, it must be seven years ago now, that I would get to this stage where there would be six of the things all beautifully packaged by the publisher Angry Robot Books. Um, would you like me to read you a little bit? I'll read, there's a little opening piece. It says, The con artist and the spy, each hiding beneath layers of disguise. Snake-like, they shed their skins, revealing new ones underneath. Thinning themselves by slivers, they wonder when the last disguise has been sloughed off if they might vanish even to themselves, and there, perhaps, find peace. I am a happy man, a very happy man.